Spencer Davis has died. He was 81. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Stream Music. Known for giving us hits like Keep On Running, I'm a Man, and Give Me Some Lovin'. He died yesterday from a heart attack in California. He was born in South Wales in July 1939. His father was a paratrooper. Spencer started playing the harmonica when he was just six years old. He moved to London when he was 16, became a clerical officer at the post office, but quickly got a name for himself. In fact, in some music circles, he was known as Professor. And by then, he was hooked on the guitar and heavily influenced by what was happening in North America. In 1963, however, everything changed. He met Steve Winwood, who was only 15 at the time checked out a band called Muff Woody, featuring brothers Muff and Steve Winwood. He ended up persuading them to join his band, along with drummer Peter York. By the following year, they were known as the Spencer Davis Group. In 1966, they had a couple of UK number one hits, Keep On Running and Somebody Help Me. And the hit the following year was I'm a Man. We actually interviewed Eddie Harden's daughter, Eddie replaced Steve Winwood in the Spencer Davis group a few years ago. I actually hired Eddie Harden's daughter at a radio station that I was running. I was a program director of the station. She just walked in one day and said, I'd like to get into radio. Look her up. Her name is Emma Harding. Great singer in her own right. And she told me a lot of great stories about her dad working with, well, her dad being a rock star, being in the Spencer Davis group. Eddie passed away a few years ago. At one point at the radio station via her dad, we almost got the Spencer Davis Group to come to Canada to perform a concert, but it fell through. And we should point out the Spencer Davis Group was one of those bands that had their hits become worldwide hits and songs that have stood the test of time. Keep On Running was not a hit in the U.S., but it was a hit all over the world. Give Me Some Lovin' was number seven in the U.S., and I'm a Man was number 10. And those two hits solidified really the history of the Spencer Davis Group because they're still being played today. They're still being covered. I can think of a certain band called the Blues Brothers. And they're still being featured in film. May he rest in peace. Have any memories of Spencer Davis? Ever see them in concert? Buy their music? Share away. Make sure you comment on our videos, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden. This is Rocky Street Music.